infuriating as he may be, he has not been wrong yet. Now, it will take more than Quercus's ferocity and my wit if you're going to survive. You need power, and I think I have just the thing. After our last escapade with your void woman, I examined the corpses you left behind. They were imbued with dark power. I believe I... Sorry, Quercus believes, and I concur, uh. that this magic can be used for light as well Interesting. as darkness. Here, try this. The squirrel lays his hand on you, and a strange feeling ripples through your body. A sense of power. Your mind opens to the possibilities of new magic. Did you just give me a memory slot? Ah, how do you think it feels, Quercus? What did you do? Is a Unusual, I admit. It harnesses the power of those that you've slain and lets you use it against those you've yet to kill. I admit, I thought it was a beautiful little piece of irony, but it is somewhat grim. I'll grant you that. But if you need proof that grim arts can lead to marvelous things, you need only look at now you have all the power you need. You were a wonderful shield as we fled, but we are not running anymore. Now you must become the axe. Cool. Go, my friend, and lay what did you give me? The forces of the eagle. Hatch them to pieces, snap their spines, and burn their eyes and <clears throat> and quickness. Uh, I'm glad that we finally got to talk to him. This is funny. Three new recipes learned. Um. Okay. You're not gonna tell me what recipes? That's a bummer. I'm done looting these guys. Um, the young man gazes at the square. Seemingly lost in his thoughts. His face and clothes are daubed in what appears to be red paint. Nearby, a canvas sits upon an easel. You see what I happened? I just see it. I witnessed it. Now I must preserve it upon canvas for the generations to come. He nods, a faraway expression on his face. The great schism of the divine order and the ruination of arcs. This will be my masterpiece. Sure, can I look at it? Hmm. I usually only display completed works, but, well, this painting's raw power is already plain to see. Here, feast your eyes. He gestures to the canvas. It's completely covered in the same shade of red, layer after layer. It's sodden, dripping onto the cobbles. Where'd you get the blood for the painting? He cracks a limp smile. He seems to be getting paler by the minute. True art requires sacrifice. Artists must put themselves onto the canvas. He tugs back the sleeve of his tunic to reveal a blood-soaked cloth bandage around his wrist. Yeah, you should check out a healer. You must have lost no, a lot of blood. I must continue. What would my father say if he was still alive to see me now? He was the finest painter of his generation, and he used his own blood for his masterwork. The final panel of Did he the die sacrifice too? Of Lucian. I'm gonna, um... Uh, you'll never <laughs> finish it if you die Self first. preservation is a petty concern. I must put the spiritual above the corporeal. I must finish. All right, I want to know about that. For the painting. most part, a copy can be seen at the great cathedral here in Arx. I visit frequently. For instance, okay, I lied. There might be a lot of side quests here. But the original pattern, the one that my father used his blood to depict Lucian's final sacrifice, was given to Lord Ken a long time ago. He keeps it locked away somewhere in that mansion of his. A masterpiece like that should be on public display for all to see. Can I trade? You have some money, so sure. 
I really should sell more crap. Because I have a lot of stuff in my pockets that I'm not using. I'm going to keep that around because I need it. I didn't identify something. Oh, holy crap. Oh! Got a lot of stuff here. Getting more and more encumbered. This was never about the I go. Sell all. Uh, maybe we won't sell those. I don't know which is useful and which is not. Okay. I do have a bunch of things apparently that I have never seen. Oh, these are the recipes, maybe, that he gave us. Why did he say recipes instead of items? Ooh, that's summoning. Oh, that's way better. Wow, he had nothing here. Streets littered with corpses. Never thought I'd see the day. Cool. Finally something new. For Vane. Alright, what kind of resistances do we need? Earth or water would be good. Let's do water. I think that's a heal. And we, he doesn't want to get healed. Alright, this is a shield. Yeah, then it, that's not going to measure up. That super awesome thing we just got on Huntsman Geo Necro. Huntsman, huh? Maybe we'll give it to Sabil. That sounds good. All right, thievery is garbage. Wits and finesse are nice for her, though. What about the joyous ring? It's a lot of life. Necromancer. I lose one scoundrel and I gain a huntsman. And a lot more life. I'm gonna do the Dragon Claw. Because now I can get her spells back. Her jump. I have to drop something, which is a bummer. Streets littered with corpses. Yeah, give me that. Wait, what? Oh! Huntsman 2. Lame. Hey, Doggo, stop slurping. Alright, I need... an actual, like, traitor. I know. Give me Jesus. The statue looms over I love her, you. Hands reaching as if trying to claw above the charnel stench. Though her eyes are blinded to the horrors at her feet, a single tear drips onto your face from beneath her blindfold. Brush the tear from my cheek. The tear is ice cold on your fingertips. You watch... But she cries no more. Okie dokie. Ada, look at my hand and I can't aim. Goofy. Who's Goofy Doggo? Citizen. Nothing there. Oh, there's a red. Oh, that's Kim. The elf stands in front of a cart displaying various sundries. He warmly motions to you and gives you a broad smile. Please hold. There we go. Give me all them resurrection scrolls. 
I think I have plenty now, but you never know. Got some stabbies. There's a lot of pinks here, dudes. A lot of damage. Lose life steal. Uh, I don't like looking through all this. Actually, kind of good. Let's see, that's good for if and lose two strength and persuasion. I gain a ton. Yeah, that's worth it. Eleven grand. Dang. Twelve grand. Don't fret, my friend, and don't falter. You needn't call to Lucian for sucker. Oh, I, already, I already saw your stuff. Sorry, mate. Manage runes. Right, what do you got? You have no air or poison resistance. Oh, critical chance. I like that. Yep. Oh, you know what? We're actually going to combine that. It got damaged. I don't know where it's at, though. No. It'll fix up just Here it is. Mythical. You're confident. I'll give you that. Where are the ruins? I welcome newcomers and natives alike. We shall train. We there shall talk. There we go. Oh, ranged huntsman and pyro. <laughs> Not what I wanted at all. Oh, this is what I actually wanted to do. Dang it. That would have done it. That would have gave me strength. Wait, what? Oh. There you go. Okay. That was all that. Oops. This and then this. What a pile of junk. Intelligence lame. It'll fix up this one. You're confident. I'll give you that. Sure, Pyro, whatever. I heard that the Paladins killed unarmed Magisters. Didn't even let us surrender. Too loud. Oops. What do you think the Paladins would do to us if they heard you going wrong? There you go. I welcome you, come as a nice little boy. We don't try to check. We should talk. This place is free, not anymore. Are we do? I should be looking at their spell books. I might have some new spells. There's a double! The town is all a twitter over your escapades at the gate. It's the perfect time to replace the hunting supplies you've lost, yes? Sure, we got. May the land sustain you and the wild game feed you, friend. Bye. What the doggo will? Sturdy bows and sharp arrows. Hey, doggo. Name's Gus. No! Come back here, Doggo. Doggo! What's going on? I smell terrible things I do. I smell fear and blood and doom and death and something else. Something worse. Then give him a ball. From under the city. Uh oh. That's not good. Ruff? Ruff? Get out of here, you dirty muck. Walk off, dude. I will end you. 
I know she's pretty, but my wife's here to work. Not to go, cat. Are now, you a traitor too? What'll it be? Now that you're all done, why don't you just skedaddle on out of here? Challenge. If they die in the next two turns, they are healed and receive damage and armor bonuses. If they survive, they receive the bonuses and cast Ooh, I don't like that. Oh, this is the melee range. Lame. Destroy all the physical armor. That's kind of cool. Get out of here, you dirty muck. I don't know that, right? Good. What's Warfare Huntsman Geo? Wow. That's awesome. Gain two constitution, two warfare. Leave damage. I lose critical chance and life steal. That's awesome though. Like that. Good me. Not that. Equip. And also. What was it? Book. Scroll, please. One. Nope. There you go. Quick. Learn skill. Rid of that. Rid of that. Rid of that. Challenge is there, but I want your this ability. That thing is sweet. Oh, it's three though, man. That's business brutal. must be booming for you. All them broken weapons. Dead magisters don't tend to buy weapons. Still, the paladins. Shoot, paladins don't need them either. They took I never the use this. Off the dead magisters. And I got rid of... Let's get coin-minded back. Cool. This episode is just going to be full of me looting... Or, looking at stuff, apparently. Apologize. I'm just the one that hammers and such. You want the wares? You speak to my wife, Fianola, over there. Fianola. Interesting name. What's in here? That was creepy. And it's going to fix you up. Hello. Creepy man. Toy seller. A visitor. Tell me, do you like puppets? Find them a little unsettling. The toy seller nods and smiles, clearly not listening to a word you said. Wonderful. Here, take a look at this. You're creepy, dude. Springs to life. That's even creepier. Impressive, no? There's a lot of craftsmanship in that small package. Quite a lot. Now, what can I do for you? I haven't had many callers of late. What with all the fuss and hubbub that's been going on outside. I want to see your wares first. Consider me at your service if you need anything else. You are creepy. The best is that important. How'd you bring it to life? Source, what else? Each and every one of my darlings has a little bit of magic in them. It turns a mere toy into a friend. How did you escape? The magistrates. I'm on good terms with the Divine Order. They know what my work entails. They've even had use for me in the past. I have nothing to fear from them. 
Aren't you afraid the void will walk in the Oh, no, not at all. I use only the smallest sprinkle of salt.